hey guys welcome back to my channel thank you very much for tuning in again for those coming for the first time welcome guys hope you guys will also be returning very soon my name is nom fundo taking off my ring because i need to wash my face i know my babe says i can do everything with it but i just take it off anyways guys i just came back from a day trip you guys probably would have seen that video and we were in Bern today with Risai. I still have a sticker. One of the museums we went to. Well, the only museum we went to. Sticker for that. I'm going to be washing my face. And yeah, guys. So let's see my skincare routine. For now, I need to take off the, the hat. My mutze. And ooh, wig. Guys. Yo. I feel so good taking off this wig. I need to brush it before I keep it. And there's so much hair here that I left this morning. But yeah, guys, I had a wonderful day today. It was lovely. Went to Berlin. And we walked around a lot. So yeah. So firstly, because I have makeup on, right? So I need to remove the makeup. I used to have wipes which I think I don't have anymore. They finished. So I will be using this makeup remover from, I bought it in Germany from Rossmann in Germany. And I will use it to basically remove my makeup because when I have makeup on, a single cleanse doesn't work. And I have makeup on today. Because you guys know, you've seen, well, you've, you'll also see my skin. I've got hyperpigmentation because of breaking out. You see, I even have one huge pimple here. There's another one, which is like a cystic one, which is like internal. It's not coming out. At least this one is like coming out. It has a head. This one doesn't. And then there's quite a lot on my face. But... This is the first time I'm using this one. I bought it because my charcoal, my charcoal wipes from Clicks that I that I've been using finished. So I needed another one. Oh guys, makeup is a lot. So I'll just use the other side as well. And just really go in there. Oh my word, guys. Oh, makeup. And I didn't even put a lot. Like if you guys saw in the video earlier on, it wasn't even a lot of makeup. It was just one layer of mousse, matte mousse. And I had... The powder the pressed powder that's it but anyways guys you see this is the makeup that i have so to wash my face i am currently using a soap from from this brand organic naturals where am i going to put this let me put it there organic naturals i it is a botswana brand which my friend, yeah, it's it's Khaboroni Botswana, yes. And so I'm I'm using I'm using the products right now. So let me get the soap. It's in the shower. I'm currently using the soap. I was using the uh, charcoal, uh, black charcoal soap, black soap, charcoal soap. So that one is finished, obviously. You see, I just let it stick together, like merge with this one, merge or whatever. And now I'm using this honey with the box. I threw away the box, but yeah. Organic Naturals. But you guys can see, you see what I'm talking about. It's like, oh, my problem is that I honestly, I pop. I pop which is very bad and I know it's bad 
So I just rinsed off the makeup as well because, because just to get out as much as possible before I go in with the soap. So I literally just leather my hands. But you guys can already see that you see the soap is white because I already removed like the makeup prior to the cleansing step of washing my face. And my word, my, my eyes are on fire, guys. My eyes are on fire. But, so what I wanted, I wanted to share was about today. Yo, guys, it was horrible in a sense that, let me rinse my face. Because my eyes are burning. My face feels very clean already. But, okay, my time has gone off. I had a timer going for something. So it just went off. But, guys, guys, I need to put a face mask on. And I will tell you about my day. So let me get paper towel to dry my face and to put on the mask. But you see, my face is cleansed. You'll see with the paper towel as well. When I use it, you guys will see that it's quite clear. So I've got paper towel. So just tap my face with the paper towel, guys. And you can see nothing no brown because i cleansed properly like a proper proper cleanse guys but to share about my day right so i'm using the vhi advanced active skincare mask i bought it at the um, fleur de lis spa in umklanga in durban when I used to go there for my monthly pampering because I would get a massage and I'd do everything, facials. And then because those people sell you things, I ended up being sold these products and I've had them for like forever. So yeah, so I use this once a week. Yesterday I had... Oh, I threw it out. I threw it out, but I had a Garnier um, hydrating mask on. So yeah. Anyways, today I met with Rusai Wonders. So I, the way Rusai and I know each other, is through social media, guys. Social media, social media. We met on Instagram after I messaged her because when I was preparing to move here. Switzerland, obviously. I needed a lot of information on long-term visa application, the D visa. So I went on YouTube and I tried to find as much information as possible. And I came across her videos because specifically I was looking for South Africans that were doing the process or have done it or whatever. So I found one of her videos. I contacted her on instagram and she was very nice she responded and then she we spoke she helped quite a lot and this is the thing guys right i honestly don't understand why people on social media act as if they are when you reach out to them and you asking about something someone can literally just say not interested or sorry i'm not gonna talk to you about it some people just ignore you completely there's other south africans that i asked timer hey siri please set the timer for 25 minutes 25 minutes counting down thank you so i don't understand why some people literally are they they act like hey for me it's like when if someone is asking you for help online and they're reaching out just respond help if you can if you cannot refer them somewhere there's this one specifically one south african she lives in germany i reached out to last year even and i asked her about a similar process that we were about to do with babe and okay hi guys i'm I'm sorry but don't understand but anyways i guess it's your life you do what you want and yeah so anyways 
we met on instagram early this year and we've been chatting the whole time we moved to whatsapp and we've been trying to meet for like a whole year but then obviously she's here she's there i'm here i'm there and we just kept on missing each other until this week then it's uh, the last week in zurich before they go away so finally we we met she suggested we go to burn and we went to burn so guys i am going to sit with this for 25 minutes and then i will come back after 25 minutes to show you the rest of what i put on so this whole thing is literally i am trying to clear my skin from the hyperpigmentation from breaking out actually i'm planning on changing my diet improving my diet and working on my gut health because it's a mess and it's i think it's coming out on my skin so it's been too long and anyways guys see you guys in 23 minutes 25 minutes later and i need to remove the mask guys and i will continue my story about today after i finish removing the mask mask gone faith clean guys face is completely clean so anyways so i drive burn is like an hour away so we plan our meeting i drive to burn i get there to a location firstly parking in switzerland is a nightmare like well yeah but parking is a thing like it's a serious issue here Okay, so I first put this hydrogel essence. Guys, I think I'm an essence girl. <laughs> I think it's because I don't know what, like I'm not a, like a skincare person. So I just buy like the, the most affordable thing that I find. I usually put three pumps of the gel. But obviously now that I'm trying to fix my skin, I will be buying intentionally. Because look guys, look at this. Oh, it is so horrible. It's so bad. But yeah, I drive. I get close to where Risai is. And there is no... Oh, I forgot to use to go in with my toner first. I usually start with the toner. Hey, it's okay. I get to where Risai is. We're close to where Risai was. And... I can't find parking so i have to drive away i tell her i'm gonna find parking and then i'm gonna walk back to you so yeah and i go i i, I got lost i didn't get, really get lost but i got lost see another essence product guys it's a hydro under eye stick to keep my under eyes hydrated guys we need to keep looking young and then the second last thing i put on is my serum the organics i told you guys i'm using some of these products from organics it's very oily during the day i don't put anything else but this usually i do three drops because it's very very oily and yeah so i <laughs> drove into the wrong parking not parking onto the wrong road where only trams and trains are allowed to be but anyways i drove i found parking i parked then as I was walking to Risai, I walk outside the parking. It's wet outside. It's been raining. And guess what? Guess what? I'm wearing boots. Black boots. Where are the boots? I'll get the boots. Let me get the boots. They're even still wet now. So I'm wearing these boots, right? I've had these boots for very long, guys. Honestly, I am not complaining. I am not saying anything. They're actually from Foshini. Hey, okay. That's why I've had them for so long. No, not that's not why, but that's why they've lasted for so long. So I'm wearing these boots. I'm walking. Next thing I feel, hey, bo, my foot is getting cold and it feels like it's wet. And I'm like, I look under the shoe. Can you guys see the cracks? Look at this. Like shoe is finished. So it was the, the left side first, this one. And then after that, I'm like, let me get my, my moisturizer. So for moisturizing, I will use this. For moisturizing, I'm going to use... This is the first time I'm using this, actually. It's new. I haven't used it. So it's a Lamil moisturizer. It's for the night. Yeah, PM. It's written there, PM+. I also got this 
when i was doing skin treatments in durban from my dermatologist she's not a dermatologist she's a doctor but she specializes now in skin and hair not hair but skin aesthetics as as why is the word yo i will put it somewhere on the video but yeah so i got the whole pack it came with a face wash a serum i got a serum i got an am cream during the day cream and a pm cream but all the other products are finished because i was using other yeah anyways so that's the other thing when i buy products i need to use them in combination and not just mix and match like this which i will do i just want to finish i i'm not gonna waste because these things i think this pack cost me like two thousand rands or something so i'm not gonna be 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 be, be throwing that away so i'm gonna finish the products and then i'm gonna buy like a pack of the same brand and use them together because i think especially if i want to correct my 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 problem i need to try use the products together because they put them together for a reason anywho so uh, look at that i walked around because it kept on raining stopping raining stopping so when we were inside i'd be like oh i forget about it as soon as we step outside and then water sips in and i'd be like oh my word it's so horrible because my my feet were frozen my toes were i felt like i was gonna get like frostbite or something but yeah guys i wanted to get boots like i even told Rasai that i want those muddy puddle boots muddy, pad muddy puddles water boots the ones that they have a, the, the ones that well a given example that you know in pepper pig when there was a muddy puddle and then the kids went there and they were jumping in the muddy puddles those kind of boots and we found some but they were very fancy not exactly what i wanted because i really wanted something just to wear at that time and because i wasn't going to take off my stockings and yeah i was wearing stockings so it was just going to be a mission having to find stockings as well new socks it was just gonna be a mission for me to buy like proper boots and change because i'm not gonna buy proper boots and then after that wear new boots with wet socks and stockings because then the new boots will be ruined basically because of the water and they'll smell so yeah so i wanted those water ones because those ones are like it's plastic you know as kudura as with talent so we found some but they were very fancy they were not like the kinds that i want like i really wanted those kiddish ones those like very very kiddish ones and i was like guys i'm not gonna be buying stuff here i'm gonna be buying in in germany when we go to germany because things are a bit cheaper in germany so yeah so i endured i literally just stayed with my wet shoes because yeah all boots were like above a hundred like hundred francs going up so yeah but anyways guys so this is my this is me removing makeup getting ready for bed i need to take this boot out back to outside oh the the one last thing that i actually put on when i sleep sorry guys i'm taking the boot outside the door because they need to be recycled but i put essence once again it's a lip mask when i'm about to sleep i put it on but every day all day i put this vaseline when i'm at home and if i can if i have a small container for example when this finishes i'm going to use this to put my vaseline to put in my handbag and be able to take because this is the best for me for me so yeah guys so anyways thank you guys very much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed my mixed up story about my day about my washing my face but all in all we had a great time we really had i really enjoyed myself it was lovely meeting you Sai. i i feel like i'm gonna keep on saying this and i'm grateful for her and i'm very thankful that she made me get into the mood to actually go out and go visit other christmas markets but i'm gonna go at night because during the day i'm like i like the lights more so yeah so anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed the video i will see you guys in the next one